Hey guys, welcome back to another part of Let's Play The Sims 3 Generations. In today's part, we're going to be doing a lot of exploring with the triplets now that they are teenagers, and we're going to be checking out some new teen sims that I placed down in Saffron Bay. In my live stream last week, I created some teen sims for this series for the triplets to befriend and possibly date, and we all got on the topic of gender preferences. I find gender preferences to be extremely important when it comes to dating in The Sims, and a lot of you guys asked if there's going to be a sim in this series that is in the LGBTQ plus community? The answer is yes. By the way, happy Pride Month, everyone. Most of y'all made very good educated guesses, and today will be the big reveal of which sim it is in the community, and I am so excited. Also, we're supposed to be celebrating Quentin's birthday in this part, but I decided to push it back a few more days when this household is less busy. I actually wanna do something special for his birthday, so instead, we're gonna be celebrating Quinn's birthday in this part. So let's get right into the gameplay. Currently, the triplets are out on a sibling lunch outing and yes they are still on vacation i decided to have them stay the full three days because who knows when the next family vacation is and i want them to enjoy their time here i purposely made the triplets come out and spend some time with each other because i noticed that briella and rylan started fighting a lot when i cut the cameras off in part 21 they were fighting so much to the point that they are no longer friends and i also noticed that alec was starting to isolate himself like no y'all need to come together be cordial because y'all share the same wound and if you're wondering what sienna quentin jace and fluffs are up to they are currently at the the park chilling well sienna and quentin are just playing some chess or whatever but they need that because their logic needs to go up and these two oh they're just playing on the in the sand what is she doing now you're trying to go home uh-uh get back over here how about you go swing on the swing with jace or something just play on the playground they made all these sand castles <laughs> Anyways, back to the triplets, but what they need to do is bond and get to know each other some more. I'm going to have them all ask each other what their gender preferences is so we can all be informed. I already know their gender preferences and I randomized their preferences and it took a little sneak peek in the last part. I didn't know you can randomize everyone's preferences using Master Controller and that's pretty cool. But yeah, right now, Abriella is talking about some art. She's going to discuss adventures, high five him, talk about cooking, and then we're just going to jump right into asking him what his preference is. What is going on around here? I hear a lady screaming. I thought she was a burglar. Oh, Lord. She looked crazy. Quentin is talking to Sienna about something. I don't know. And then since when? The, oh, my goodness. Who told Rylan to run home? I'm really going to get him. But we can't miss this moment right now. He better get his tail back here. What? Let's just fast forward. Okay, here comes the big reveal. I'm so excited. <laughs> Really need to act a little faster. God darn. Hurry on. Okay, period. Alec, let him know. Alec likes men. Y'all better turn him up for real. So to be realistic, we're going to say that only his sibling knows that he's gay. He's not going to be coming out to Sienna and Quentin anytime yet, although he knows that they will be very accepting. Now that that is done, I'm going to bring Alec back over here so he can at least join the conversation. I don't know who told him to come back up. Ooh, ooh, what are y'all doing? Why is she being so disrespectful lately? Yo, Briella has a bad attitude going on right now. What did you do? How about you apologize to him? Can you apologize? That was a hot freaking mess. And she's still going on. Complain about what? Girl, you are ruining the moment right now. Okay, express humiliation. And I'm gonna have Alec ask her some few questions. Let's ask about her gender preference and let's ask about her day. Dang, she ruined the moment. Dang. And then let's talk about art with her since she likes art. It looks like Rylan has completed a skill. Who are you talking to? Who's this? Is she a teen? Look at Rylan macking on some teen girls already. What's her name? Jen? Okay, we can get to know her a little bit. You never know. Let's ask about her age and her career. Is, is she a young adult? Ooh. Ooh, she thinks we're hot. And it looks like they have like some sort of attraction. How would you guys feel if Rylan were to get into a long distance relationship? I think that would be so cute. But knowing Rylan, he might try and cheat on poor girl. So she's unemployed. They are the same exact age. Um, this lady, it stuck somehow, some way. Um, she's ambitious. Let's ask about her sign. See if she's single. And then I'm going to switch over back to Briella and Alec. Did we learn about her? Did you ask her what she likes? Ask again. We missed it. 
Ooh, charisma skill level three. All right. Okay, so he feels a little humiliated from whatever Briella said to him, which is very disrespectful. Okay, so Briella is straight. All right, period. And um, you know what? They are done conversating. They are on good terms. What she needs to do is talk to her brother because they are not on good terms. He keeps talking to this girl. I think he likes this girl. Let's ask him about his show, gender preference, ask about his day. And then I'm going to send them home so they can all return back to Saffron Bay because it is getting late and they're going to get sent home automatically. I just like how Jen is in the middle of their conversation. Um, Jen and Rylan just became friends and apparently she has a boyfriend. Let me show y'all. I think his name is Jason. Yep. Um, where's Jason? Is he here? No, he's not here. I don't think he's here, but listen, Rylan is a bad boy. Let me tell you. Yeah, he's not here. I think I might leave her alone. We don't want no smoke. So we did learn that Rylan is straight as well, period. We love to see it. Um, What else are you going to talk about before I have them head home? Okay, discuss adventures, talk about art like usual, and then we're going to have him talk to her. Hopefully the deep conversations mod can allow them to be friends again, discuss favorite TV shows, Um, complete about status quo. And let's do something funny. Let's tell a funny story. Oh, we can dare her to do something. Dare to... Oh, imply someone's mother is a llama. I can definitely see him daring her to do that. <laughs> and we want to see some drama anyways. It's fun getting to know you, of course. Um, Y'all good friends now? No, not yet. Still acquaintances. Where are you going? Okay, you're going back home, which is good. I'm going to send them home around like 1030 or whenever these two befriend each other. Jen, dang. She's invested in this conversation. She could do a nice makeover. <gasps> okay, they're almost there. Okay. Um, And how about you ask him? Well, how about you guys gossip? Y'all look like y'all would gossip about something and ask to be protected because why not? You're my brother. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. A little gossip here and there. No, let's not complain about anything with your diva self. And let's give him a hug. See if he takes this hug. Briella didn't do her dare, but they are back on good terms. And that is all that matters. Time to go back home, y'all. We had fun. Oh, look at her little outfit. Looking all cute. Oh, it's 1045. Y'all need to go. Everybody flirting. Let me check on everybody back home. Read to sleep, read to sleep. Oh, no, 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 no. Wake up, pack your bags, back to Saffron Bay we go. Y'all are all trying to go to sleep right now. Vacation is over in one hour. Yeah, let's pack our bags and let's go. Well, let's wait for these two to get home. Hopefully they took the same taxi. Y'all are whack. <laughs> like what? All right, so I will see you all back in Saffron Bay. We are finally back home. Sienna is cooking up some dinner. I was going to play Saturday off camera because I kind of dislike how time is paused when Sims are on vacation. But I'm actually going to use this time to introduce you to all the Sims that I placed down. Starting with the Jones family. Here's Arela. She is so gorgeous. I made her on stream, but I wasn't too happy with how she looked. So I redid her. Arela grew up in a very wealthy household. She's the only child for now because her mother is currently pregnant with a baby boy and they are very excited her parents are married they don't have the best marriage because her dad isn't so loyal but they are trying to make it work for the sake of Arela and the new baby on the way Arela mom sherry is a businesswoman and her dad darren is a firefighter now i would show you what they look like but i would have to go through the friends list and i don't feel like doing all that <laughs> next is the gonzalez family here is giovanni he was also made on the stream i got a request to make him look like zane and i gotta say he kind of looks like the younger him giovanni was raised in a middle class family by his mother who is a single mom giovanni's mom name is Rosa. She is a stay-at-home mother. Giovanni doesn't know anything about his father, nor does he want to know anything about him because he missed out on his whole childhood. Also, Giovanni has a older sister, but she is currently in college. <laughs> Lastly, we have the Brooks family. This is Sky. I made her and her twin the other day. She has a twin brother named Silas. They are identical twins raised by their single father named Scott. Now, Sky and Silas don't look identical anymore because he is now a ginger. He dyed his hair. They were also raised by a middle-class family, although they're about to be really well soon because their dad is a three-star celebrity working as a director sadly their mother has passed away many years ago and she will be forever missed so yeah those are the four sims that are going to play an important role in the triplets life and i hope you guys like the storylines that i made them because i really want to show that not every family is perfect in the sims all right it is 7 45 everyone should be eating dinner i don't think everyone ate 
Let me check. Okay, Briella looks like you already ate. What are you doing? Have a quick drink. I'm starting to think that these counters is like a bar or something. And these cats keep crying and whining in my ear. Like, what are you doing? Oh, they're play fighting. <gasps> oh, that's cute. Who is this? This is Simba and Foxy. I'm hollering. Okay. Um, somebody come get these pancakes off the floor. Briella, can you clean it up for me? And let me check on Quinn. She is going to age up in two days. So I'm going to assume she's going to age up on Monday. Um, she needs her diaper changed pretty soon, so I'll wait until she starts crying. Let me check on Quentin. Quentin! Oh, you're teaching Alec how to drive. Okay. Yeah, let's finish that real quick. Where are y'all? Where'd he go? Learn to drive. Yeah, what are y'all doing? Oh, you're at the old house. Look at these horses! They are so gorgeous. No, seriously, why are y'all so far apart? Okay, there we go. Quentin is gonna teach Alec how to drive. These horses is peeing at my old house. I don't know what they doing, but they need to go here somewhere. And let me check on Sienna. What is she doing? Oh, she's just, you know, getting a crack a lack and dancing or whatever. The cats are sleeping, which is wonderful. Turn the darn radio off. I mean, come on. You need to use the bathroom. I keep forgetting there's a bathroom right here. I keep sending the boys all the way upstairs to use the bathroom when there's a bathroom down here. Oh, y'all are tired. I guess you guys can head to bed. It has been a long weekend. Um, you need to use the bathroom after your mother, so. Why is Briella in their <laughs> in their room? Like, girl, you have your own computer. I wish we could set ownerships on the computer. Did he learn how to drive? <gasps> he did! Yes! Period, Alec. Okay, so Briella's gonna be next. She might learn how to drive tomorrow. And I see. Quentin wants to join the law enforcement crew, which is not going to be happening. I don't know what he's thinking. Let me teleport him over here. And you're home. Great. I'm so proud of you. Why do you keep putting that outfit on? You have a new every day. The heck? Listen to accus- Briella. Briella, accused of being a diva. Let's see this real quick. Let's see her dramatic self. <laughs> she always trying to start something with her siblings. Look at this. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. She needs to get yelled at. Let me get Sienna to yell at her real quick. Oh, Sienna's sleeping. Uh-uh, Alex. Scream at her back. What are you... Huh? See, he's trying to make you feel better about life. So, let's mock divas. Briella is rude. She is a mean girl. <laughs> She's ugly. All right, enough of that. I'll warn you to stay away. I'm pretty grumpy right now. Girl, we don't want to talk to you anyways. You're ignorant. Okay, you're going to eat, use the bathroom, and then head to bed. Brielle, you need to take your grumpy self to sleep or something because that is ridiculous. Where are you? Where are you going? Clean? No, you don't need to clean the toilet. You can go to sleep. Use your own bathroom and then go to sleep. Yeah. I think Jace and Fluffs went to sleep, if I'm mistaken. Oh, she's sleeping. Jace! Oh, he's reading a book. I think all the kids like reading books now. But anyways, we will see them all in the morning. It is now the morning. I'm trying to wake everyone up early so we can get some things going on. Sienna, Rylan, and Fluffs are the only ones up on this lovely Sunday morning. For today's agenda, Briella's gonna be taught how to drive. And I'm gonna send Rylan out to meet Giovanni. I would have them meet naturally, but who knows how long that would take. I can definitely see them being best friends because of their personality. Giovanni doesn't live too far from here, so let me show y'all where he live. He lived right over here in this nice three bedroom house with his mother. It's really cute, it came with the world. Are they here? They are home, but it's like too early to go over somebody's house. So we're gonna wait till like 10 a.m. maybe. And I lied, Briella is up and she's having a mood swing today. <laughs> she is not feeling it. She wants to skip school. Maybe she can do that Monday. Stop being friends with her own mother. Yeah, that's that's crazy. That's about it. And um, this dude over here, Mr. Alec, he wants to punch Briella in the face for all the things that she said to him yesterday. Cause y'all know they got in a little altercation, but no. He is not a fighter type. We're not going to have him fight anybody. When he wakes up, he's going to eat his breakfast and have a good day. Oh, there's no more leftovers. Dang. Okay, how about you serve some breakfast then? And then I'm going to have him take a shower upstairs because their bathroom doesn't have a shower. All these radios keep turning on. How's Quinn? Quinn needs a bottle and her diaper change soon. Who wants to do it? Sienna, go ahead. Oops. Give bottle and let's play with her a little bit. 
Oh, what's this? Learn science skill? Well, you need to so we can complete your lifetime wish. Y'all want to make drinks so bad. If y'all don't get out this darn kitchen, how about here? Teach your daughter how to drive now so I don't forget later on. Teleport, teleport. You're in Alex's way. He's cooking. There we go. Now ask your father to teach you how to drive. You'll eat when you get home. I'll just drag it to the middle for the both of you. There we go, along with his hygiene. You know, I'm gonna drag his hygiene all the way up. Who's watching TV? Dang, you're still sleeping? Oh, honey, you need to eat and take a shower. Come on, let's take a shower first. Let's go, get your day started. <laughs> uh-uh, one of these cats just threw up. Which one was it? Wasn't you? You outside. It wasn't you, who? Let it be you. It was. Now that's just nasty. Mm, who wanna clean it? Um, okay, she's learning how to drive. Stop watching TV. Clean this up for me. And then let me sell this. They're not going to university yet, but they will. Let me make sure y'all did your homework too. I believe you finished it on vacation. Yeah. All of them? All of them. Amazing. Let's look at Briella. Let's see how she's doing. She took the right car. That's good. Taking her good old time. She wants to stay out after curfew. <gasps> we can do that tonight. And she also wants to insult a teen. Hmm. She can insult her brothers, become friends with somebody. <gasps> yeah, definitely. All right. I didn't have Alec register for any after school activities. I was going to have him work in the science because I can honestly see him working instead of doing after school activities. I got to think about it. Can y'all see him doing something after school or working? Because teens can have a part-time job in science, I believe. If he were to do an after-school activity, I can see him doing something like in a study club. So, you didn't even eat. So grab a plate of that. Sienna, why are you eating again? Oh my, he's choking on the yogurt. Um, Let me see what Fluffs is up to. She's just watching TV, chilling. She needs to use the bathroom too. Mm, Y'all need to put the toilet seats down. Come on, little boys. Cats, mm, you need to eat. Ooh! Is that Miss Foxy hissing at people? It sure was. Benji, come and eat and scratch. Here, you can scratch on that. Oh, I'm dragging the rest up. I don't feel like dealing with it. Ooh, Quinn. Quinn needs her diaper changed. Oh, great. Y'all are good. I love this family. Yeah. Okay, Alec is now signed up for a study club. I might have him work and do after school activities. Like, I can see him being very successful in the future. And independent. He is independent. All my kids are independent. All right. I like how y'all don't do y'all dish. Clean up for the whole house. Oops. There we go. Who in the pool? What's the temperature? Oh, 89. This is perfect. Here, Fluffs, join him. You're always a fish. Fish in the pool? Since when? Come join him. It's a nice day. She's always on the computer. She might be a computer whiz when she get older. Mm. No, we don't want to go on a date with nobody. Stop asking me that. How far are y'all? Did she just come back home? Uh-uh, she better get back on that road. I say this all the time, but these kids never listen. They do their own thing and it bothers me. Oh my gosh. Anyways, I let time go past me and it's 12 o'clock and I forgot to send Rylan over to Giovanni's house. So we're gonna do that right now. He gotta take a taxi because he doesn't learn how to drive yet. Um, you, y'all supposed to be on the road. I don't know what they thought they was doing, but she's going back to learn how to drive. All right, so now we're here. Hopefully he's still here. <laughs> He might have left. Oh no, he's still home. I gotta fix their household name. It's just a period. Period. Somebody gonna answer the door? I see somebody home. Ooh, attend a party. You want a party already? <gasps> we got invited to a party. Well, Sienna did, but um, we're not going. So here's Giovanni. Y'all let me know if this dude actually looks like Zane. He kind of does. Hello. What's up? He wants to befriend Giovanni already. See, I knew they were meant to be best friends. Okay. Now, let's get to know him. Ask about his career. I don't think he has a job. His age. 
and his sign. Ooh, wanna be friends? Already? Yes! Of course. So they are friends already, thanks to the deep conversations mod. Ask if he's single, let's compliment his house. It looks really nice. And what else can we do around this piece? Enthuse about new car because I believe Giovanni is a car enthusiast. He knows all about vehicles. Um, oh, I forgot. Rylan is actually friendly too. Now that's crazy. Rebellious and friendly and hot headed all at the same time. Mm, a nice combo. Keep getting to know him and his traits. Give him a friendly hug. Oh, Briella is now driving skill level two. Just one more to go, and she is good to go. They all want to attend a party. Maybe they can throw a little house party next part. Did we learn anything? Whoa, which y'all got a cat too? Did y'all just hear that? That split splats on like a cat vomit. I could be tripping because I got all those darn cats in my house, but hey, he got cat toys. See, yeah, he just saw a pet. Who? Uh uh. I know the cat did not just vomit and we heard it all the way over there. We sure did. That's nasty. Come clean it up for me. Why do I keep doing that? I hate that. I need a mod to stop these cats from vomiting. Oh, honey, use that litter box. Yeah. Anybody else? You need a scratch. Come and scratch. You, take a little nap. Mm, they hissing and all. Okay, back to Giovanni. All right, so we learned nothing. What is taking you so long? Let's complain about that. Admire him. We did compliment his house already. Hmm. Special. Oh, finally, we learned something. He's rebellious just like him. Briella, are you done? Are you finished? Oh, no, his charisma is really good. So Rylan wants to invite a sim over, so we're going to invite over Giovanni and introduce him to the family. I think Briella would really like him. I think she would like a bad boy, you know? Are y'all almost done? Oh, she is stressed out. Oh, honey, honey, honey. <laughs> Stop being friends with Quinton. Oh, Lord. Okay, y'all can take a break. Come back later tonight to learn how to drive. Oh, she is cutting up. Go ahead, go home. Okay, he's gonna bring his friend home. Did he say yes? Period, he's coming over. Let's go. Meet the crazy family with all these crazy behind kids. Um, Sienna. I guess you can start preparing dinner since it is 4 p.m. All these freaking radios! They about to get deleted! Oh my goodness! Oh no, Quinn! She needs a bottle and some social. She sleep though. They say never wake up a sleeping baby. What are we doing in anyways? Wake up, little one. There we go. Oh, who's this? Oh, move out the way! Do something else. Read a book. I don't know. Oh, he's here. Okay. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Look at Briella acting like she don't see him. She know he look good. Come on. All right. You're going to introduce yourself to him first. Although you're really starving. <laughs> look at the way he looks at her already. Yo, what's up? Oh, he thinks she's hot. Hold on. She wants to be friends with him too. All right, let's ask about his age. Let her get to know him a little bit. Ask his gender preference and his sign. Quentin, you're struggling. Did anybody get the baby? No. Oh, Lord. Mm. How about you make some dinner? It appears that I am two days older than you. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. No, we have left. No, we don't. Serve dinner. How about we all have some salad? Or we could use the grill for the first time. Let's make some hot dogs instead. Y'all getting the baby? Are you gonna feed her? Uh-uh! Sienna wants to have another baby! Yeah, y'all crazy. Someone come clean this toilet. Alright, what y'all talking about? Alright, I'm finally ready to try this again. Let's get to know each other. Oh, 
Yo, he likes Briella. He is digging her for real. So Giovanni is a Pisces and he is straight. I don't know if we learned that earlier. Um, do you want to sleep? No, not yet. Let's end these about a new car. Because you know, we got our license or whatever. Room, room. Um, consider attractiveness. Even though he said she was hot. And can we get a compliment? Can I request a compliment? No, don't even do it. They're going to start arguing. We don't need all that. Um... Ooh, tell a dramatic story. I think he would like that. And let's talk about art. Ooh, she wants to kiss. <gasps> Yo, it's getting spicy already. She want to kiss Gio already. Let's see if they can get like a little flirt in. Hopefully we can meet the other teen sims in the next part. Um, That'd be really nice. Ooh, girl is starving. Don't worry, your dad is making some dinner. Watch a movie, maybe. They both want to have another kid. I can't afford that. We don't have no space for all of that. What are you doing? Eating some waffles. She'd be doing her own thing at this point. Uh, free to roam. Make sure you do that dish. I'm going to have her head to bed early too since she is tired. And she has her first day of school tomorrow with the, the kids. Uh-uh, Sienna. Laying all in your daughter's bed. Here, come use the bathroom. Oh, he's talking about her beauty. Recognizing beauty. Oh. She about to steal Rylan's best friend already. Come on, let's dance. Let's dance together. <laughs> Stop being friends with Rylan. Oh my goodness. All right. Quentin, is the food ready? Don't tell me you made one hot dog. Don't tell me you just made one hot dog. Oh, okay. I got nervous. Woo, I got nervous. Reach level six, six in the cooking skill. Yeah. But now everybody needs to come down here and eat. So, call the meal to everyone. So, even Gio is welcome to eat. Oh, look at them grooving. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Everyone is eating. Giovanni is still here. He is welcome to stay until 9 p.m. Because my kids got school tomorrow. All right, education comes first. All right, somebody's finished eating. Oh, you're going to brush her? I mean him. Oops. Anyways, you know what? How about we talk to Jen? Let's see how Jen is doing. Let's text her a friendly text and um, not insulting. We can't even talk. Oh, yeah, chat. See what she's up to. Let her know you're back home or whatever since you guys are friends now. Um... Old friend, what? Y'all just became friends. You're, you're and you're getting tired, so I'm gonna have you just go to bed. Why are y'all crying? Why, what, what was happening? Ah, uh -uh, you're not gonna get on the computer. You're getting tired too, so you can go to sleep. She didn't even learn how to drive. She didn't finish it. Ugh, oh, she can worry about that another time then. And all of you, children. No, 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 no. No more TV. Why are you fatigued? Probably from all that swimming. Dance for three out. Yeah, you tripping. We ain't dancing nowhere, but in my house. It is now the afternoon. The triplets just got out of school. Everyone else should be getting out of school and work pretty soon. Once everybody is home, we are going to celebrate Quinn's birthday. I am really excited to see what she looks like. And guys, prom is this Wednesday. I can't believe we're having prom so early. The triplets are definitely going to slay. And Briella actually got the wish to ask Giovanni to prom. She also wants to kiss him, but I accidentally canceled that out. Right now, she is actually at his house. He invited her over over and she's on his computer playing video games how about you guys do homework together that'd be really cute he's really digging her i like it <laughs> another pretty cool thing that just happened at school was that alec met silas at school which is really cool um he already wants to befriend him and he wants to learn his signs so maybe when he's done his homework we can invite silas over and get to know him some more um sienna just came home what's her problem Okay, well, it looks like she is anxious to advance. She wants to get a promotion, but it's not happening anytime soon. Um, girl, we need to celebrate your daughter's birthday, but let me clean this dish before we have company come over. Oh, dang, I can't even get it. What a coincidence. Anyways, also, Alec got his, whatever this certificate is for learning how to drive. Congrats to him. Oh, we need to get baby Quinn. What's wrong with her? She needs a bottle and some social before we age her on up. I wish Quentin was here to see his last child grow up, but he is currently working overtime until 6.30 in the morning. I don't know why the hours are so funky, but he's making money, okay? Bringing home bank. 
Let me see what these two are doing. It looks like she is finishing up with her homework and then when she's done, she can talk to Giovanni some more. Where is his mother? We haven't seen her yet in this part and she is drop dead gorgeous. Let's show him a funny video when she's done and then let me see if he will take a little flirt here and there. I don't even see the option. Um, just gossip. All right, we need to celebrate this little girl's birthday before she ages up automatically. Great, she's in your hands. I have the cake downstairs, nice and ready. I hope, I, oh, Sienna's tired. Sienna better get it together. Here we go, baby Quinn, the last baby. Well, hopefully the last baby because these two both want another child. And I don't think that's happening. We don't have this space. Who wants to clean up these toys? Oh, little girl, I hope you did your homework. You need to when you're done cleaning. I can't get this dish. Oh, there we go. Let me just drag this in the garbage. There we go. Now these cats, let me see what these cats is up to. Be no, no running around, use a litter box. You're good, you're good. Oh, hold on! Let me get my picture. Baby Queen, yay! Aww. Ooh, that was a funky angle. Here she goes, now I would record this moment but Quentin is usually the one to record, but you know. We still have love for the both of them. Yay! Happy birthday, Quinn! Oh! Let's get a little look. Oh, she got. Oh, she looked like Quentin. She sure do. Y'all, look at this. Oh! Yup, she looks like her father. Mm, 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 mm. I was hoping she was gonna look like Sienna, but oh, her jeans aren't so strong. All right, everybody's gonna get a slice of cake. I will give Quinn a makeover off camera. I need to download some more toddler CC and she needs to look like a little cutie, you know? All right, you are supposed to invite over Silas. I can definitely see him and Silas maybe dating in the future if they have like a really good friendship. I don't wanna have them jump into a relationship right then and there. Ooh, Silas is coming over, yes. All right, Brielle, you need to get home. Oh, there we go. She wants to kiss him. Should I have him? Oh, I should have kept the honor roll. Man, see, I be thinking too fast. Be flirted with. Oh, so this is what we're doing. Do you want to kiss him already? <laughs> yeah, why not? I'm in. Let's do it. No, 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 no. We're not rushing it. We're going to let it flow for a few more days. I can even have her ask him to prom. I don't know. Give him romantic red flowers and compliment his parents. They need to get home because it's getting late and there's a curfew. Like, girl, you think you're grown, but you're not really grown. I am going to end this part right here. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. And I will see you all in the next part. Bye, everyone.